Oh, my hair is a mess. My hair is a, net, a mess, but anyway, what's going on, guys? Let's go. Uh, Midnight Lazy here. Unless you uh, remember me from my old name, Mike the Blaze, whichever one's fine with me. And we're back with more Red Dead Redemption. We're gonna do a uh, West Dickens job next. Oh, you guys know, after I ended the video yesterday, I kept I uh, went after one deer just because I saw it. It was on the way, and then I saw another, and it, you know, went down that rabbit hole. There were a few rabbits as well, but uh, I'm hoping my mic is a little bit better today. I know the last video was not so good, but uh, I apologize for that. And you know, I've been trying to adjust this new one because it is better, but I just have not been using it right. Oh, it's the street. What is that? Sister. I get a new one. Oh. oh, I've been waiting. Hello, John. Oh, we'll watch this. John Marston. I can't believe that. No. Do I know you? I hope no, so. my hair's a mess. I seem to know you. I'm pretty good at remembering faces. Are you? Do you remember Hattie McCourt's face? Who? She was a girl Dutch Vanderlyn shot in the head on that raid on the ferry a few years back. Same one you got shot on. Pretty girl, until her eye was hanging out by a thread of tendon and her brain was plastered over a wall. Not really. Then why would you remember me, friend? <laughs> You've forgotten far more important people than me. What's your game, friend? I don't have a game, John. Listen, sometimes I just wish I'd known more about life. I wish I'd had better guidance. A friend of mine, as drunk as a skunk in the saloon on Thieves' Land. I think he's going to be unfaithful to his dear wife. Why don't you head over there and see if you can advise him how best to proceed? What do you think I am? I know what you are, John. Just if you've got the time, friend. <laughs> Smug. I can't believe that. My horse. My horse. I don't remember his name, but my horse. God dang it. Uh, yeah, see, I have $500 now. I literally, I sat there for like 20 minutes just killing things over and over. Things just kept spawning. I'm, just, I'm glad I can, uh... Wait. Oh, the, the horse has... Full trust still too. Look, I have full stamina on this horse apparently. But uh, yeah, I was sitting there. I would kill a deer, and a uh, hawk would fly up, and those feathers are like worth a lot. And then uh, I would. Well, howdy. Oh, sorry. Excuse me, friend. I'll keep going after. Mind if I rest up at your camp a spell? That'd be my pleasure. Man needs a break from this desiccated land. Thank you, Mister. Say, what's that stick you got there? Oh, y'all ain't never seen a dowsing rod before, mister? Never seen a man summon the water up from the bare earth? Uh, mister, uh... Marshall. Bill. Ah. Bill Williamson. No, can't say I have. Hmm. It's water you're looking for. What's wrong with that lake over there? Oh, there ain't nothing wrong with Lake Don Julio. Nothing wrong with it, but we lack the fancy irrigation equipment you folks have back east. Man needs a wellspring on his proper tie to ranch here. 
<laughs> Makes sense. Yeah. Why, you know, just last week, I was over at Old Pleasant's house. Now, I think I may have found something, but... Old coot that owns the place threatened to call the law down on me, so... <laughs> People act funny around strange men with sticks. They sure do. Damn fools. Bet you he don't even know how much water's running underneath his proper time. Proper time, you mean to tell him? Why is he saying proper time? <laughs> you know what? You ain't that stupid, mister. And I can tell. I'll tell you what. Why don't you go get the old man to sell us his proper top for a small pittance? Then I can find mm -hmm. a source Call of that every time. Build us a proper wealth frame. Proper time. Maybe I will. Well, all time. right then. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're not gonna do any side quests. We'll do an, like a whole video on side quests and stuff. I'm just collecting them, you know, doing the original. I forgot what I was talking about. Oh right, the animals. Yeah, I'd uh, I'd take out one deer, then another one would be nearby. I'd take it out. A rabbit would start hopping by, and then a hawk, and then, you know, it was just that giant, giant rabbit hole. You know, it was, after you kill one animal, another one comes, and then another. You know, and it was just. I know that that's what this game is, you know, like, in the second one, you gotta actually, like, you gotta actually have, like, a, a ho it on the horse, and, you know, you take it back with you, but in this one, you just kill, and you just get it back, you know, you don't have to worry about that. Let's talk to this, Let's talk to this lady, who was not spawned in fully. Everything all right, madam? It miss. Oh... Oh, let me look at you. That's you. My gentleman caller. You remind me of my Peter. Have you seen him? I don't think so. Where is that man? We'll be late for the ceremony. He must still be at the saloon in Armadillo, <laughs> talking to the musicians. He's such a fine man. He's such a fine man. Must be making things right for me, as usual. Well, I gotta get going, ma'am. I'm sure your Peter will be just fine. Wait, I beg you. <laughs> get your arm, get your hand off me. <laughs> that was great. This was meant to be my perfect day. Please, sir. Something must have happened. I can't bear it. So you want me to go find your Peter so you can have a perfect day? Yes. Please. But what if I want a perfect I'll see day? See what I can do. Oh. You gonna do something for me to have a perfect day? Like go kill Bill Williamson for me? That'll make things easier. You know, I still don't know what we should name the horse. Uh, what did I? I named the other one Bill. Did, or no? It was Susie or Shane. That's right. Depending on if it was a boy or a girl. This one's gonna be Charles or Chrissy, depending on the gender. Oh. Hello, Mr. Mr. West Dickens. Old Swindler Blues. I hope you guys actually enjoy this series. I know. Oh, no. Oh, wait. Excuse me, I thought sir, it was gonna take help? longer to load. Mr., you alive? Motherfucker, God damn it! Good <laughs> heavens! Excuse me? I said, no, I'm not okay. Do I look like I'm okay? You look pretty good for a corpse. <laughs> Praise <laughs> be. <laughs> Move up, mister. Sorry for the noise. Get you to a doctor. Or an undertaker. Get in front of me. St. Peter, open up them pearly gates. <laughs> I'm, I'm coming, coming home. home. <laughs> Come on, mister. Come on. I love how he just laughs at him as he's thinking he's dying. Come on, West Dickens. Hurry, sir. You fancy I'm man. Like a badly butchered hog. You'll be fine. Just focus. Let me yell at you while I'm standing right next to you. Sorry. I, I know I said I'd stop talking to you. I don't think I'm strong enough. I'm finished. Done for. <laughs> just sit up straight, will you? Finished. Done for. Head for Armadillo, friend. I'm 
do this so I don't have to worry about staying on the road. John Marston! God! Out of the frying pan into the fire! Excuse me! I'm trying to save your life, you old fool! You keep annoying me and maybe I'll change my mind! I got I'm so weak, you don't want to Shut up, but I got it. Meter is zero with me. Oh, okay. What the hell happened to you? Bandits, hoodlums, <laughs> the scoundrels robbed me blind. So much easier to drive. I can see that. You don't have Once to control again, it yourself. I'm a victim of my own success. They see a man in a well cut suit and this happens. Do you know who they were? No idea. I'm not the kind of man who has enemies. <laughs> Come on, don't stop. I'm begging you. Do now. I would put that gun away just yet, sir. I'll be fine. Don't be out. I implore you to please stay on the road. I am on the road. Face. I knew you'd come. Where's ever go? Faster job! Faster! It's beginning to really hurt. Eh, you're not even halfway dead yet. Calm yourself down and stop it. <laughs> this is it. You're gonna make it. Oh, oh. Where the devil are we? Armadillo. You made it safe. You'll be happy to know. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You're a gentleman and a, a true man of honor. Coming from you, I doubt that means much, but I appreciate the civility. I owe you, sir. And I always pay my debts. Uh, Jesus. But if I die, I'm sorry for it. If not, I'll be your man for, for. Let's get you fixed up first. Then we'll decide what you're my man for. <laughs> After that. Right, let's see what this lady has to say. I know she's been standing out here for a while. Who did? He's missing. He's only a youngster. My boy is missing. Where? Who took him? Them people in the hills. Them hills near Hanging Rock. They took him. Can't the police force help you? No. They can't even help themselves. Please, sir. My son is missing. I need your help. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. That sucks because I know what actually happened. I remember that one. Go and do Marshall's mission next. Just since we have to wait for uh, West Dickens again, so. <laughs> ah! Since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? No. Not particularly. <laughs> Listen, son, I know you got a mission. But right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? We've had this problem for months with this group of bandits who are getting drunk and murdering settlers. Last night, they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. Women folk then got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other kind, sir. <laughs> Need a little swig before we go. <laughs> hey, wait up! Hurry, Quiet, lady. Your kid's dead. I mean, uh, all right, boys. Nothing. Move it out, Marston. I hear you caught up with Mr. West Dickens. I did. For a man who claims to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic is so I know they're gonna keep talking people. during this, but uh, I just want I want to want to talk about. Something. I don't like conversations about. I wouldn't be so dismissive of science if 
while with you. Times is changing fast. Never mind. He's no, no more a scientist no. than I am a priest. That conversation is a little too too much for, ch for my channel. He's certainly a character. I, I know I know what this game is about and stuff like that. I know that this is like old school and stuff. Like wild Wild West days. But the fact is there's still people that think like this. That women aren't just be a dead critter. More than just used for sex. And it's annoying. But that's that's another thing. There's some people I know that were talking about stuff like that and I don't like it. It's really pissing me off. Man, this don't look too good. But yeah. Somebody was so busy killing people they went and dropped their gun. I'll just take it for myself. Come on. Sorry. I, I, I don't usually talk about stuff like that. I don't usually talk about like personal life stuff. With people I know and stuff like that. But I just, I had to bring that up. It was really pissing me off. I don't get why they, uh, why people think that still, you know? I think it's this land that makes men. As much as the other way around. Men are born, and then they're formed. At least that's how I see it. Who could have done such a thing? Any number of people. Especially now the word's out we're cleaning up the county. Between Walton's boys and the rustlers, my dog was making noise in my morning. Either my dog or my cat. And one of those two always do it. Poor <laughs> vultures. This don't look so good. Alright, let's go check it out. I'll check it out, don't worry. Yeah. Hmm. I think everything seems okay here. Man, <laughs> just die. walk over the dead body, Luke or Jonah. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> He's just like, man, there's dead people here. <laughs> like, come on. I agree. Yeah, but not like that. It wasn't our way. At least it wasn't my way. Killing and thieving's never right, boy. No matter how you dress it up. What if you dress it up in a pretty Listen princess this outfit? I got a bad feeling about this. Split up and search the area. John, you check the buildings in the barn. Shed's clear, Marshal. The Marshal's clear, Shed. I mean, nothing. I think there's going to be a part that I have to censor out right here. But we'll see. If I remember this, this part... Correctly, I'm gonna have to censor something. No one here. Which means I'll have to figure out how to do that. <laughs> Come on. There's no good reason for that to be boarded up. Break that door now. Get your gun ready. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is what I need to censor. Yep, that's exactly what I thought. At least the body that's up in the air. Holy sweet mother of mercy. Please, please don't shoot me. Some bandits came by and took us hostage. They're holed up in the farmhouse. Some of my family is being kept hostage inside. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Just running by a window. I broke the window. Yeah, you guys, it's safe. I already killed everyone here. Like, I, I think there's someone in here. Move out of the way, Marjo. You and me gonna have our There's a deputy Shot him in the air. Shed out back. Make a run for it when it's clear. Oh, thank God. 
I don't know why I thought he was to the right. There'll be a deputy waiting for you. Thank you. They said they were gonna kill us all. Let's all, right. all clear, fellas. Let's check up on the farmers. Let's uh loot their house and steal everything they own. That's what I heard. And then loot all the dead bodies around here. <laughs> I like how you can just search everything and just take their money and stuff. I'm the law right now. I can do what I want. One ammo. I did it, guys. Twelve ammo. Nice. Pretty sure all you get is ammo from these areas. Or at least this one. Jump over that chair real quick. If it ain't me, it's someone else. All your stuff is belong. All your stuff are belong to me. Hello, friend. Chasing him down like wild dogs. I thought you were supposed to protect us, Marshal. You folky men. You ain't nothing. You're just a man on a government payroll taking money that the rest of us have to pay for with our lives. Yeah. What is wrong with this country? Not up, men. The man that kills the boss of that bunch gets fifty dollars. It ain't about the money, Marshal. <laughs> These are people's lives, people's homes. <laughs> People's lives and their people's homes. Marshall. You know, their people's lives. Their people's homes, Marshall. People. You know, like the other people's who are people's. Yeah. Duh. Maybe. All this sure looks like their handiwork. Makes sense if they took this road. Come on, Marshall. This might be our chance. Yeah. Words. Anyway, Let's just say he's the currency in a complicated transaction. What the hell you talking about? Some <laughs> people I have the displeasure of knowing want him dead. Why does that involve you? We used to run in a gang together. He was once like family. If this is how you treat your family, I'd hate to see what you do to your enemies. Why well, shoot him? Bear in mind, he's left. Is that somebody on the cliff? He's left me. Is that somebody on the cliffs? Well, I wasn't talking anyway. Walk away now, John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Dude. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. <laughs> you know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. I <laughs> wish <laughs> not as you were yep. an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! Such a coward. Right, take cover. Still gotta Imagine. stand behind all these people. Big old baby Bill. Killed every man so far. Nobody leaves this Who do you think you're messing with? He tried to run away. Nope. Look what I got here. 
here. <laughs> There's something that you're still breathing. <laughs> Come here, boy. <laughs> Come on, Missy. Give. <laughs> oh. Oh. Norman Deke. Let's see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is going to help us get to Bill. Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Deke. Mighty kind. Fuck you. Hog time. Let's get him to jail. <laughs> I got the pit I'm good, and they're not. That'll be. As I'm collecting all this money, I'm going to say I appreciate you guys watching. And uh, I hope I see you guys in the next video. Be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, ring the bell for whenever I uh, upload. I'll probably start doing premieres for these episodes. Just so that I can watch them live with you if I'm not currently at work or something. And uh, yeah. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. Uh, be sure to share it if you did. I'm trying to get to a... Well, no, actually, go follow me on Twitch. I'm trying to get to affiliate before my birthday. I'm at 20 subs. I need 50. Not subs. Uh, followers. And uh, I'd appreciate it if you guys go and follow me over there so I can get up there, you know. So, but if not, it's fine. Just uh, I hope you enjoyed the video anyway. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.